Welcome back to B D D D E. Where we like to waste money and have fun, but we don't seem to be wasting that much. We seem to be had a great smashing box last time. We're up to our bottom left. Hopefully, it's got our fable in it because I deserve it. Maybe I don't. Maybe I don't. Let's find out. And the box can tell if I deserved it or not. Lady Luck says that I deserved a legendary and a fable in the same case. So if I go pick a card, any card, I'm picking a fable because I love fables. In, even more so in Coffle. Display it. Yep, we haven't cleaned up properly from the last video. But that's okay. That's okay. Don't get me up. I'm just having too much fun opening. I'm, not, I'm just not even going to try anymore. It's the one that stayed inside the box, so we're going to open it first. Let's rip into it. Should be a little more careful. You never know what's going to damage a card. Zoom, zoom. Yeah, we have the technology to zoom in beautifully. Ah, it's good. Getting a bit used to seeing all these comments again and again. Oh, Foil Majestic right off the bat. <laughs> I hope it's going to be a good one because that's a rainy razor and it's quite beautiful in the foiling. Awesome. Life of the party and a slice and dice in red. Uh, well, why not? We'll do this for last pack. Take the warriors out. Seismic Surge. Some foil. Oh, well, that's going to go over there. That's better than the others. Hey, we've got, uh, what is it? Icelander. Um, there can only be one. Obviously, I want home cold foil, not just in regular form. Uh, but that's two Majestics in a row. It means if I want to play and build around it, I can just play it as it is. But we're going to get cold foils. Because that's how we are. We're greedy here. We've got to buy all the cool ones. Uh, we have a T-Boner. We have Smashing and a Quake. Mr. T-Bone. Not the life of the party in this particular case. It's just a regular schmuck. Ah, uh, Shrill. Pick a... Uh, Pick a card, any card, and a hazing. Yeah. And I have no idea what I'm going to build apart from more warrior. Um, or potentially go to go guardian because we already got the cool new shield. Um, I don't know what's going to be better yet. I'm not that great at the game. I'm alright. Uh, steadfast and foil. Looks pretty good. Amulet and a hundred wins for the rare, uh, second rare. Warriors. Uh, wild Ride. We have something interesting in the back there. Don't know what that is. Amulet, and we have our Merchant Hero. Um, let me have a little read of him because I don't. I, I glossed over this one. I think last time. Once per turn, pay two for. Uh, so each other hero, you put a card. So what? Each other hero may put a card from their hand on the bottom of the deck. If they do, they draw a card and you create a silver token. If you gain no silver this way, draw a card, go again. So, it's not a bad thing. It's going to be more PvE or something or, you know, like 2v1 or something. As a support character... Hopefully we can get him in cold foil next. Hopefully we just get our fable in cold foil and we go, yep, we're done. We don't need to open the rest of those boxes that I bought. And, um, Timekeeper's Whim, Potion, and Gandalf the Flamethrower. Hmm, Mr. Miyagi yet again. I'm too good for this shit. And... Uh, veiled intentions. 
Talismans and Mr. Giggity that released the tension for everybody. Oh, so much, so much beautiful cards. Talisman, of get the fuck out of here. Uh, we have Pry and Foil. The Arcane Lantern looks good. I, I think it's going to look good in Cold Foil. High Roller. Swing. Uh, 100 wins. We have our Talisman of Warfare. Ooh, what's this? What's this? It's an attack reaction. Warrior attack reaction. So we have to read this. So it is... This is a uh, yellow, so... And it says cost zero. It's got three defense. Until the end of a turn, target two-handed weapon gained. Whenever this would deal... Uh, we deal damage. Instead, you may destroy a defending equipment with uh, less than the damage it would be dealt. That shatters it, so that's pretty cool. Until the end of the turn, target 200 weapons. So, you know, if you got a big axe or something like you have here, like a big axe. Maybe we're going to get big axes for a warrior. 200 axe for a warrior, that'd be cool. Uh, whenever this would deal damage. Instead, you may destroy defending uh, equipment with uh, with defense less than the damage this way. So you could just brutally destroy people's way of keeping them myself alive, knowing that that's could be in their hand, and then they suddenly have to defend it. They would be upset. That I think could be very cool for warrior to use to be able to help deal with certain situations, especially in classic constructed. Nice sideboard, I think. Might even be want to have one main board of uh, from Blitz. Oh, sorry, I can't put that over there yet. I've got to go through them all properly. We've got to do a uh, recap, of course. Ride the Tower wins. Oh, we have our Cold Fall already. Uh, amulet of Intervention. Cool bananas. Put that here. Mr. T on his bike again. Jesus. See that card so much, it's, it's it's gone to me. Mr. Miyagi's there, of course. He's there telling us what to do. Zoom in, looks pretty cool. We have a high striker and a guardian. And out of there. Frostbite, go away, you're not foil enough for me. Uh, Draining Dire. Miss, uh, like, again, Gandalf with his fucking flamethrower. Just going at it and giggity release the tension. Seismic Surge, nobody cares. Uh, Life of the Party foil, it's alright. Uh, the full art's better for the promo. Talisman of Tithes. It's kind of cool. We had in caught a full array. Release the tension. Giggity. Uh, pyrotechnics. Well, she's about it's pyrotechnics. Amulet of Nothing and Runeblade uh, Incantation. Yeah, I'm sure some of these cards are better than I think they are. I just I'm, I don't have time to read all of it right now. I'm just gonna keep pushing through because I enjoy it. I'm just want to see the really cool stuff. So, uh, we have a Dilution Sphere for our Foil Majestic. Enter the area. Um, the arena with a steamed counter on it at the beginning of your action phase. Destroy this unless you remove a steam counter from it. Whenever a hero would be dealt that uh, dealt exactly one damage, prevent it. In the beginning of your action phase, destroy unless you rem unless you remove a steam counter from it. Whenever your hero, so you can't you got to better put steam counters on it to keep it there. Yes, so you can remove it. Um, I haven't read up enough to know what's going on with that, so it's 
Sorry, guys. I got nothing. And Gandalf is there. Sorry. Don't understand mechanologists enough. I really gotta start learning that. I think we got a normal guy in the back. Macho Grande. Even bigger than that. And we have our regular Bravo star of the show. It's okay. That's three, actually. Three different characters in this box. Alright. Too bad they're all regulars. Not all coal foils. I think I deserve them all coal foils in this box. Can't see it. I'm smiling. I'm a cheeky bastard. Uh, read the guild path. Alright, cool. Whatever. Talisman of Cremation, Cool, and Mr. T again. I know he doesn't look like Mr. T, it's just because it says T Bone, and then I'm just thinking, I uh, pitted the fool who lets me ram him up the side. Oh! Now oh, the full art. Thunder Quake Extended Art. Woo, foily. That's cool. We're going to call that a special hit. We have f actual fire breathing. Uh, that's going to be pretty cool. We have a double majestic. You saw it here, right? We have a double majestic. I guess one of them must be the uh, uh, the carnival slot. Maybe that's the carnival slot. Who knows? Pulverize Guardian. Look, you're hitting for 14 in a single thing. It costs you 10, though. Um, hits a hero their first attack during the next so if you hit the next one it gets a negative four so it's like oh, I take 14 pass uh, wow that's kind of cool fire breathing it's what is it instant one fire breathing gains plus one activate this ability only when fire the breathing is attacking so obviously if someone doesn't block it and then you have a ton of cards to pitch you got all blue so that's some uh, a lot of damage you didn't block and if you need to force through a bit of damage, uh, we have the skull form smashing and slice and dice. We're gonna put that aside. We don't have our slice and dices. We've got like now four packs left, ladies and gentlemen. Find that fable that I deserve. Maybe I don't. Maybe you guys all said that I don't deserve it, and that's not very nice of you guys. Um, bear fangs. Amulet and Mr. Gandalf with a flamethrower again. Boo. Alright, the novelty is uh, some of these particular cards are starting to wear off on me. Um, mainly because I am not thinking about building with them yet. What we care about is. Ooh, Blade Runner. Put that aside. Clarity Potion and a hundred wins. Two left. It's Fables in the last pack, I reckon. Rai, Rion, Talisman, and High Roller of Balance. That cares about that. I don't know what it does. I haven't read it, guys. There's a lot of talismans out here. Uh, Phantasmal Haze. No, we're not getting anything too special on the last one. Um, we did get a, another Runeblade Majestic, it is, um, Runic Re Reclamation, when it hits a hero, destroy target, or they control, if you do create a Rune Chant token, it's kind of cool. Uh, alright, but so, we didn't get that much on this one, this is a low end box. Wish I had the boxer and the last one to go out and an absolute bang, but we have the uh, card we just got. The Runic Re Reclamation, the Fire Breathing, pretty cool. Pulverized, I mean, it's a ridiculously cool Guardian card. Full Art, Thunder Quake, we have Bravo, Star of the Show, non Cold Foil. Um, Dissolution Sphere, Shatter, looks amazing to me. Concepts. Um, we have obviously our merchant. We have our new elemental uh, young hero wizard. Um, so she's a nice wizard. And 
the Rain Razor, and we have the Cold Foil Amulet of Intervention. Alright, obviously this box wasn't as good as the last box. Um, can't always have, you know, three Cold Foils in a single box, one being a Legendary, one being a Majestic, and one being a Amulet. Can't always get such good luck in every box. But I hope I get this, that kind of luck in every case at least. Anyway, I really enjoyed opening this case. I hope you all have uh, enjoyed watching it. I hope you're all getting your own cases and opening them and enjoying those cases to the absolute must. Um, anyway, let me know what you think of Everfest so far. This is just the first case. I will be doing more uh, once I get a chance. Um, it'll get, obviously, uh, probably by the time this is, comes out, um, this last video comes out, I'll probably have more already done. So, can't wait for that. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that's all we've got time for here at B-D-D-D-E, and we'll catch you all next time.